10 minutes ago, my cousin called me and said, hey, I got free tickets to Maui, but we gotta go right now. So we're flying standby. We have a couple backup plans. If we don't make it to Maui, I'm racing right now because flight leaves at uh, 4.45 and it's 2.50 right now and I'm an hour away from the airport. Don't forget to swab the back, just, just in case. Check that drone thing too. Yeah. Whew. If I just make it to the gate, we'll get to go to Maui. And if not, we're going to Nashville. Yeah. Made it. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go to Maui. Here we go. Impromptu That's trip it. to Maui. <laughs> this is looking fun and not stressful uh. at all. Oh, yeah. Oh, really? <laughs> nice. Thanks so long. Thank you. Can I thank you? Once we got to Maui, all we had to do was book a hotel, get a taxi downtown. Okay. Um, all set. And 20 minutes later, we made it. <laughs> Welcome to paradise. <laughs> Here's the tour of our hotel. That's it. Jeffrey got us a car rented for the next couple of days. Ouch. We're going to drive from Lahaina is where we're staying. We're going to end up driving out to Hana today. H-A-N-A. -A, Hana. Which means we started out from right here. Oh, shit. That's... Not working at all. To right here. Hana. Lahaina to Hana. So we got to rent a car and we hit the road. Now it's beautiful and scenic right from the very beginning. So green, so lush. And we made our first stop. Oh, that that doesn't look very good. But it was back on the road for our second stop, which is actually really cool. We went to the bamboo forest. And that was really pretty. That's, that's pretty. See? Yep, that's bamboo all right. And you know, hiking through the bamboo forest, we actually just at the start had to hike across a haunted bridge. But it wasn't that haunted that day. It was nice. We hiked into some waterfalls, watched people jump off the waterfalls. Found a rope swing, watched somebody swing off the rope swing. We copied him. So just did a bunch of hiking, got some pictures. And before we know it, it was back in the car, on to the next spot. The beautiful rainbow eucalyptus forest. It was awesome. I got to fly the drone up over the canopy of the trees. God damn it. Just fucking shit. That could have been so much worse. It just knocked the battery out. And broke the wing and broke the rotor and now I'm sending it back because it's broken. That's amazing. What an amazing device. <laughs> I'm just gonna find the battery. Ah, there's the battery. Ah. Yeah, pretty good. Well, we got our pictures there. And it oh, that's too bad. It wasn't all bad. It just meant no more drone footage for the rest of the trip. Oh, come on! I mean, there's no shortage of wonderful photo opportunities. We got some really nice pictures throughout the whole trip. 
It's not like it's a picture. Because I mean, it is a picture. It's gonna be, I'm gonna take a picture. For sure, a favorite spot was Wainapa. This place. It's a beautiful black sand beach. It's like almost nobody there. I'd never seen black sand before. So that was actually really cool to see that. Felt like kind of like playground gravel under your feet, which is cool. We actually yeah. hiked around through this kind of volcanic rock area and found this place that we could just sit down and watch the waves crash. And it was really nice. Buddy Turbid Seas. Turbid Seas, baby. <laughs> Almost got me, huh? It was just fun talking <laughs> and <laughs> hanging out and wow, climbing on the rocks. Back. And back. That is beautiful behind you. You don't look so good, actually. It was really pretty back there. Definitely the highlight of the road trip was just that hanging out time, but we got back to the car so late, it was like already dark. And Wait, what? what? Uh, okay. I was going all the way around the edge. I thought down. we were going to go back the way we came. Han is the very tip of the island. So I'm pretty disappointed. We just drove for like four hours to get to Hana, and then just drove through it and didn't even see Hana. So we saw it. We went through it. Yeah. I can look back on a map and see that we drove through on it. But it was still a great day, and the best way to cheer us up was just to pick up a hitchhiker. The slippers get wet. I usually walk all the way. I don't What's care. your name? Terrence. Hey, Terrence. How you doing, man? Good. So we dropped him off a couple miles down the road where he needed to go. All right, yeah, no worries. Enjoy your trip. All right, good night. First hitchhiker. Whew. Whew. Sitting back, the whole time I was covering my neck. Like, don't, don't have a piano wire. <laughs> if he has a piano wire, I'm screwed. But he didn't have a piano wire, and it turned out to be an uneventful, dark, rainy drive home. So. Had a great drive on our road to Hana yesterday. Now we're heading out for some surfing today. Nope. Didn't go surfing. We went snorkeling. And at $1.50 for a mask and snorkel set, we couldn't afford not to. So... Picked that up, went to the beach. Definitely the most touristy thing we did, but it was fun. Saw like the biggest sea turtle I've ever seen, but a lot of people saw that sea turtle too. Uh, before we knew it, it was time to head back and head to the airport. Damn. Uh. Yeah. Driving to the airport right now, adventure's not over until we actually get on the plane. We're still flying standby home. So they only have space for one person on this flight, and Jeffrey's gonna take it because he's gotta go to work tomorrow. So, see ya. Thanks again. Yeah. Great trip. Yeah. Have yeah. a good flight. <laughs> Hopefully, I get on the next flight because if not, I'm sleeping in the airport. Made it on the flight. So, now it's over.